this is Nick at Atlantic Laser Scanning. Today we are going to do a scan registration. No targets were used. It is an outdoor scan and the scanner used was a Ferrofocus S150. Let's take a quick look at our opening screen here. We have uploaded the scans from our SD card and we can go directly into registration. You can see that a cluster was created automatically and go directly into starting auto registration. We will leave top view and cloud to cloud as the default registration method. Most of this should already have come together uh, from the scanner in the head. And we'll just do register and verify should just take a couple minutes. Now that the registration is over, we'll go ahead and let this load our scans. They look to be in the right array. We'll let that load up and take a quick look before we say that they're correct or not correct. Now that everything is loaded, we can tell this is set up correctly. As you can see here, we've got our initial scan, triple zero, one, two, three, four, all the way around to 11. And as you see, number 12 was conducted uh, in the threshold of this building. This is where our uh, interior and exterior scans are going to uh, coincide. This is a very critical scan here, number 12. And uh, at further videos, we'll be able to show the interior scan of this building and how this scan number 12 is going to bring the outdoor and indoor together. But as you can see, we've got no targets. We had a registration that came together quite simply with the S150 scanner doing a lot of this registration in the field. And we're going to just say yes, that they are registered correctly. And here is our green light uh, cluster. We go to explore. And I'm just going to right click on the scans folder here, on the scans cluster, and I'm gonna have all the scans loaded. We're not going to be able to see these scans in a correspondence view unless they're loaded because we have no project point cloud created. So we can right click now, go to view. We can go 3D view, structural. We're gonna to go to the uh, 3D view since we saw the correspondence view in the prior uh, scene screen. That's going to show the colorized uh, point clouds of each of the scans. This correspondence view is going to give us uh, what the actual project is going to look like here. Now that that's loaded up, we've got a non colorized point cloud of our project the exterior of this building. And that is how quickly a project is going to come together for you. About anything under 15, 20 scans, you're going to look at a registration time of maybe 10 or 15 minutes depending on the power of your computer. But in general, uh, this is a size project that comes together very quickly. We're going to move on in the next video and remove some of the different objects from the scan and go through a series of other things that can be done with this data uh, quickly, easily, and hopefully it'll answer some of the questions that you might have coming up on your next project.